I am Gaia Rubera, Amplifon Chair in Customer Science. Customer Science is the fusion of three ingredients. Marketing, which is the understanding of customers, data, hopefully big data, and machine learning. The goal here is, first of all, to identify, measure, and systematically understand key customer phenomena. For instance, in-store customer experience. Of course, in order to do that, we need to have systematic data, which means that we need to have data about each transaction between each client and the firm. Once we gain this systematic understanding of individual phenomena, we can move to study relationships between a phenomena and hopefully identify causal relationships between them. So, for instance, we would like to understand what specific type of marketing action leads to a specific customer experience and in turn lead the customer to buy a certain product versus another one. In order to do that, we need marketing theory, which we can test with data and machine learning models. Audio analytics is the study of audio data. In the past years, we have seen an explosion of research about textual and image data, while audio analytics has been partially neglected. The reason probably is that through social networks, we have access to a lot of textual and image data, but there is not so much about audio data. We are going to see if Clubhouse is going to change the picture, but right now, the main source of audio data that we have is call center recordings. We would like to analyze these recordings and see whether we can identify some audio features, for instance, the emotion, the stress in the client's voice, or how fast the operator and the client talk, how loud they talk, and whether these audio features can lead to a certain specific outcome. The outcome could be either the satisfaction of the client with the call itself, or even more important, how the relationship between the client and the firm goes on. So for instance, if the client decides to book an in-store appointment, or even better, if she decides to order the firm product. The Amplifon chair in Customer Science will have three main pillars. First one, research. We say that to study Customer Science, we need to have data. So we are going to augment data that is freely available with some of Amplifon data about their transactions with their customers. Second, involvement of the students. In the past years, Bocconi has heavily invested in creating a data scientist, so it is just natural that some of these students are going to work with Amplifon data, we are going to develop challenges and competition. And third, outreach. The new knowledge that we are going to generate will be disseminated to the academic community through scientific publications and to Amplifon through meetings with their employees.